Good morning, everyone. This is Rick Santos, and I've got your Monday morning update for Baker to Vegas. If you haven't done so already, I ask that you jump onto YouTube and click the subscribe button on our YouTube page. And that YouTube page is Baker to Vegas. I encourage you to let your runners know about the page. Uh, there's going to be a lot of important updates that we post on there, informational videos, as well as course information. So as we get closer to the race, I'm going to continue to post stuff on there. So please uh, push this information out to runners, volunteers, follow vehicle people, personnel, everyone involved in the race. First thing on the agenda today, Friday before the race. So uh, the day of check-in. The meetings that we normally have on Friday are no longer going to be hosted at the hotel. What we're going to do is we're going to put all this information on YouTube, and that includes the team captain meeting as well as the follow vehicle meeting. So all of that, instead of going in person, will be on YouTube. So again, like I mentioned already, you click that subscribe button, you'll get those alerts immediately. The race is only six weeks away. It is approaching quickly. Don't forget, April 9th and 10th at the Rio. If you haven't made your room reservations, I highly suggest that you do it now. I spoke with uh, the Laprac board earlier this uh, this week, and we've got one week left for reservations. So again, jump on there uh, onto the BakerVegas.net website, click the travel accommodations, and book your room. Uh, like I mentioned last last update, that rate that you see includes your resort fees so there's no additional fees that includes the resort fees your rental car reservations i'm not sure exactly what's what's going on with galpin how many vehicles they're going to put out i know a lot of people use galpin uh, i've used them in the past but uh, with things the way that they are i'm not sure exactly how many vehicles they're putting out so if you haven't already gotten your your follow vehicles in your team vehicles use the enterprise a discount site there on bakervegas.net. It's in the same tab as the hotels. It's under travel and accommodations, and you will find the tab for enterprise. Enter in your information and book your vehicles through there. The follow, I'm sorry, the volunteer information that was due on Saturday. <clears throat> so the due date has passed. We're still missing quite a few teams, so please get that information into us. We're working hard at, at making sure that we fill all these positions. We want to get that information out to your volunteers so they're aware of what they're doing. Uh, however, we can't do that until we get all that information in. So please get us the name, the email address, the telephone number, uh, their last assignment if they're returnees, and their requested assignment for this year. When you send that email in, Please, in the subject line, put team number, insert your number there, volunteer information. Adina's flagging all of those, and she's putting that list together. So please take care of that for us. The estimated runtime, that is coming up. That is going to be on March 9th. So on March 9th, I'm going to need your estimated runtime. Once again, you're going to submit that through the registration website. So that's registration dot bakervegas.net on your team you're just going to click the edit button and you're going to insert your estimated runtime that's going to be right under your category just insert that time click save and it will update your information the communications form if you haven't done so already please make sure that you jump on to bakervegas.net uh, race course communications, and I believe it's the first tab under there. Complete that information. Just have your team number with you and uh, an emergency contact. That's all you need. Make sure that you have that and submit that form. I'm happy that most of you are, are on that, and I'm getting a, a daily list of teams that have completed that information. So, so great job. But just make sure that if you haven't done so already, please don't wait till the last minute. Make sure you get on there and, and complete that. Continue to use the website. <clears throat> so even if you uh, aren't ready to, to invite your runners and, and post your runners onto their legs and all that, I understand. 
but at least mess around with it. Uh, invite your runners or people that you think are going to run. You can always delete them if you choose to, but familiarize yourself with that website. Uh, questions keep coming up. There are how-to videos on the BakerVegas.net uh, website as well as our YouTube channel. It takes you directly to there. So there are how-to videos. Take a look at them if you're having difficulties. If after you look at them, you continue to have difficulties, then please go ahead and, and reach out, and uh, I will try and walk you through that. Stage 18. These are the questions that keep coming. What's the word with stage 18? So I'm headed to Vegas on Thursday, and I am scheduled to meet with the construction company on Friday. So I should have a better handle of what's going to happen Friday morning. As soon as I get that information, I will try my best to post it onto our YouTube channel so that way you guys can see it. Um, but like I said, that, that meeting is going to be somewhere around mid-morning, so I'm hoping to have an answer somewhere around noon. As soon as I get that, I will post it. A couple big announcements. Uh, first of all, I'd, I'd like to thank all the agencies who submitted interest uh, in being the honor guard and for singing the national anthem at this year's award ceremony. Thank you to all who, who submitted your entries. The honor guard this year is, will be the U.S. Customs and Border Protection, the Tucson office. So congratulations to them. They will be the honor guard at our award ceremony. And the national anthem will be sung by Arlette Lee from the IRS Criminal Investigations Division, uh, Las Vegas office. So thank you all. Uh, if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out. As always, my email address is b2vcoordinator at laprac.com or my cell phone number 714-313-0054. Stay healthy and stay safe. Take care, everyone.